Well, hello, my berries. It's me, Darkberry32. Where do we go from? Where do we go from here? No one can save us, save us from keeping clean. Well, good morning. I am out getting my walks out the way. And then I can go to work, so I'm doing this early. So that I don't miss so much time. Yeah, so um, I'm just about, oh, uh, you know, I'm out of breath a little bit because I am still at it, guys. Tomorrow will be officially a week. And I am so stinking proud of myself. And let me tell you one thing that I'm proud of myself about. And then I'm going to continue and try to hear it so I can get on back to work. Or get to work. Um, so, I've intermittent fast the entire week from 2 to 10. So proud of myself on that. Um, I stay within my calories. I actually uh, under. Um, I've been gaining extra calories because of my walk-in Fitbit is awesome. Um, I, I'm thinking about doing a Dear Dark Berry until I can get, until people start emailing me their Dear Dark Berry questions. I'm thinking about doing one for this coming Wednesday on, um, on what I'm actually doing because I know I've been giving you guys little bits of information here and there and I kind of got a history behind what I'm doing and I know that it's going to work for me and especially because you know now I'm 50 years old and I know a lot of people used to say all the time you know oh when you get old it's going to be harder and I don't know if I necessarily believe that or not but um two years ago I did it you know what I'm saying so um, the only problem that I have issues with is maintaining so that's gonna be something way down the road after I lose this weight and then start trying to maintain so um, that's one thing so y'all let me know if y'all want a video on that and I can do that for you it's a little cold out got on my little furry my furry pal uh, I love it because it's warm it keeps me warm but it's not heavy so um, I'm able to run and walk with it no problem and if it gets too warm I can take it off and tie it around my waist uh, yeah so I just wanted to come on let you guys know that uh, it is <laughs> it is Friday honey and the weekend has begun and I'm so happy about it the first full weekend like you know full week and full weekend of the new year and we got through it so it was busy I'm not gonna lie work was really busy um, so yeah but while I'm on I want to let you guys know if this is your first time tuning in to Darkberry 32 I would like to say welcome and I want to let you guys know exactly what type of videos I do I do everything <laughs> it's probably nothing that I really don't touch except for maybe technology but um, I do cooking videos I do decor videos I do clean with me videos I have done thrifting videos um, I do shopping videos I also um, from time to time um, like to you know dibble dabble in outfit of the days you know things like that I haven't done that in the past I want to say what six seven months I haven't done that but I normally would do outfit of the days a lot <laughs> being at home there's not much to do uh, as far as clothes you know I kind of wear workout clothes a lot of the times um, because we haven't been really going anywhere because of this pandemic but I hope to get back into that too um, so yeah that is me in a nutshell and if that's some of the stuff that you enjoy then go ahead and click the subscribe button say hello you know let me know that you're joining I really am trying to grow my channel um, so if there's anything within that realm that I just specified let me know and I can bring you more of that uh, type of video and all of my old subscribers or my subscribers who've been around for a while 
the same with you i am trying to bring you guys content that i know that you will enjoy all right so let me get all back right, guys so y'all saw me walking this morning someone had a garage sell out so i think i saw a piece that i could possibly use um near my vanity area so i got earl we're just taking a quick 20 minute break it's lunchtime actually so we're taking a quick 20 minute break around here to see if it'll actually fit where I want it to fit and if it's will have enough capacity to get what I need to get underneath or off of my vanity to kind of clear it out because sometimes if I want to edit there I can keep going straight let's go back at right hand side you'll see it so we'll see check it out well, this is the garage so I'm not sure if piece I was looking at but I don't think it's gonna work all right guys so I'm eating a cafe steamer by healthy choice it's a barbecued steak and potato um, with a little sauce and a few little vegetables and then I have like a Hawaiian roll that I'm pairing with it and then I have you guys know I love my buy drinks and I'm getting ready to watch a little bit of Discovery Plus. I think I'm going to watch um, Magnolia Table and watch Joanne and Dane's Cook while I wait on emails. And that is my day so far. <laughs> okay, so I went back to the garage sale, excuse me, um, for a certain piece that I saw. And I'll show you guys if I can input it right here. I'll show talking about and it dawned on me while I was sitting watching um while I was watching uh Joanna Gaines and it finally dawned on me oh my god I could so use that for my makeup palettes or for um my cookbooks in my house and I was like oh in my kitchen it looked so good it's kind of like that farmhouse look to it got back there and it's gone but I did get a Kate Spade bag <laughs> so I don't know either me or Kayla would like this this is a cute little Kate Spade summer bag got it for three bucks so um yeah so I'm gonna walk back to the house I walked all the way over here it's not far but it's to get me some steps or whatever and uh but you know sometimes I don't want to just grab junk and then like oh my god I don't need it you know what I mean so yeah and somebody just brought that black thing that I did go there for and she sold it for a dollar y'all so that would have been a good deal too but I don't want to just pile junk up in the house like I said so yeah this is what I got Kate Spade back <laughs> all right y'all we're gonna try an experiment I want y'all to see how she reacts to Jordan okay Jor at her she loves him all he has to do is enter into the room go ahead pet her you know that's what she wants <laughs> but then she doesn't like she doesn't trust anybody but she loves him every time he comes into the room she meows at him you're so spoiled. And then if I walk out of this room and go into my bedroom, she will find me. She will knock the door down and just stare at me like, what are you doing away from me? Do you love Jordan? Do you love him? Do you love Jordan? I know you love him. You love Jordan, huh? It's time to get those nails clipped. <laughs> she's so sweet sometimes. And then sometimes she's like the devil. And not like evil, but like 
mean. Like she doesn't want anybody to touch her or do anything. Oh, she loves him. Where are you? I'm trying not to get my. I'm trying not to get my uh, computer in this shot. <laughs> Love. Do you love him, Chloe? Are you in love with Jordan? Y'all listen to the cray cray in there. Oh, y'all want to see if Kayla kept her room together since I did the whole makeover? Let's go and see. Say hello, dear. Hello, dear. <laughs> okay. She's on the phone, but we're going to come in here anyway. Hi, Kayla. We're coming to see the progress of your room. Okay. As you can see here, we have a basket of snacks. Let's see. Oh, wow. How those things are still sitting in Mother, the... listen no, 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 to no, no, me. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, she's the red bonnet. Let me see. What's another name for a bandit? Robber. She's the red band... The red... Bonnet robber and the yellow bonnet bandit. Look at my ketchup and mustard. Anyway, she told me that last night that she was going to clean before she goes to bed. And already we're getting a pile. Now, it has been, it'll be a week tomorrow. So, she still has things hung. Which is nice. Look. It's still nice and clean over here. I'm very proud. And then, of course, our pillow's on the floor, but that's only because she's in the bed. And Ginger's area. So, not bad. I would give you an A. Yeah, I give you an A. Not an A minus, not an A plus, just an A. Because I think you've done very well. Because you are, you know, kind of messy by nature. I need to find a sign. Messy by nature, baby. So you are the red bonnet robber tonight, today, right? I think we're gonna go sh do some shopping. I don't, not a lot of shop. Not no, yeah. I don't know. Are we? You Kayla? might want to back it out. Yeah. See, she don't love Wait. Kayla like that. She just live. <laughs> and there's an animal moving underneath my bed, and that she might be. What's that out. pillow on the floor? What this one? Yeah. Oh, because see, you have you pushed my mattress this way. Oh. It's supposed to be pushed this way. I just haven't pushed it back yet. Oh, okay. Um, did you want to go somewhere after I get off of work? I have an hour and a half. If you don't, I understand. I guess. Maybe. I need a, a. You need a what? Fanny baby? pack. Oh, you didn't do that yesterday. Yeah, I did, but I didn't like them. So where are we going to go for a fanny The only one the other one had was a clear one, and then this one only had the one that you have. Oh, you That's went to both of those places? Yeah. Mm. I just want, like, a basic. Where could we go? I have no idea. I was thinking maybe five below, but I don't know. They have them? Huh? I don't know. Well, I ain't trying to go everywhere. I just want to go. Let's see. We will see. I think I want to go to... I want to go to, like... I know you get tired of it, but maybe Marshalls or Ross. I don't think I'm going to do Burlington. But I wonder, because remember that guy was saying that we were in an awkward week? And maybe we should go when there's... Maybe we should go to all three of those places. And we can hit all three of those places in Humble. You know what I'm saying? Where's that way? Yeah, in Humble. It's not Humble. That is Humble. What is that? Summer Creek. Humble. Not Summer Creek. I don't want to go to Summer Creek. But it has Ross over there. And Marshalls. And Berlin. Oh! You know what I was thinking? Where? Oh, I guess because I still had at home in my head. So that's why I was thinking, oh, we can go over there, hit Burlington, hit Ross in that one shopping center, and Marshalls. And yeah, I guess you're right. It's because I have smart particles. Okay, so yeah, we'll go to Summer Creek and just kind of ways we're not doing anything i'm not buying anything <laughs> Bye. and I, we're only looking at home stuff unless i find some more rachel zoe no no she's gonna buy something 
Whatever. I rest my case. And y'all, Kayla, who took the purse? Mm -hmm. Who went to get the purse? I did. And used the credit union's money. <laughs> yeah, I call her the credit union. I had to borrow some cash from her because I don't hardly ever carry any cash on me. So I went to her and I was like, how much cash do you have? And she told me. And I was like, mm, I don't know. Because I was trying to buy this one thing and I didn't know how much it was going to cost. So I was like, let me go to the bank. And so Jordan was the bank. Because Jordan usually has a little bit more. So I called her credit union. But she has very high interest rates. Yes. You know me. 2000 mm, I'm not borrowing anything else from her. Look, see how she's sitting there? She's sitting there because she knows I'm in here. And she does not. I guarantee you what I'm saying. Dang it, Kayla. I was going to do something. So I'm going to try to shut this door. And I guarantee y'all she's going to try. I'm going to see. She may break into the door. I'm not sure. Because Kayla just picked up that pillow. <clears throat> and she's she's definitely afraid of Kayla. Like, she don't like Kayla at all. So. Mm, girl, you are. Stop it. That's your dumb. cat. She's dumb. Stop it. Well, she shouldn't have stuck her nail in my arm. And I pulled That's the bandaid off. Were, and it pulled my arm here off. You were torturing her. I don't think she's going to come because... She's oh, wait. Jordan just went out. Jordan's messing with her. Anyway, I gotta go back and finish watching Magnolia Table. I'm watching. Magnolia and y'all, please excuse my my. Look at my hair. Look at this. My hair is just out yeah. of control. Y'all yeah. should see Kayla's hair. It's pretty. Cause you know some people we just wake up and shake our hair. Shut your mouth. And go. She's getting on my nerves, y'all. I'm gonna look better than this when I go out. I'm going to try to do something with myself. <laughs> but all I've been doing is walking. Walking in this cold weather. But anyway. Don't we look beautiful? Beautiful. By the way, this is a towel. Yeah, it's a towel. The one I don't wear my bonnet. So. It's honestly the best towel ever. And I will be taking this. And you're probably not going to have a problem with it. Because you probably don't want it. Nope. Don't nope. care. It doesn't match anything. Nope. So anyway. um, What was I saying? Hair. Gonna do something to it. Yeah, I'm gonna do something with myself. I, like I said, all I've been doing is walking. Let me see. How many after steps? After recess. Do... <laughs> what is it called? After Ooh. recess. Look at my hair, y'all. Like, a... well, I have do been it on out. the other side. I have been out on recess yeah. because I've been walking in the wind, and I'm just looking raggedy, -dee, but that's okay. I know y'all gonna take me as I am. The Lord does. He takes me as I am, child. Anyway. You shouldn't have said that. Take me as I am. <laughs> All right. We're gonna take Kayla as she is too, cause honey, we don't we don't need nothing else to happen. Baby, this child right here. What would I do without no, her? I don't know nails. You see how this looks? Oh, y'all see my own. See, when you do your own nails, you can have nails anytime you want. You know what I'm saying? Let me see yours again. How y'all doing? <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go I back and watch. I about being in a nail salon locked in there for days. <gasps> With no mask. <laughs> Freak me out. I've had those dreams. Have y'all had those dreams? Are you somewhere and somebody's all in your face talking to you? You got no mask. And you're like... Oh my God! They don't have any mask. I don't have my. What am I thinking? I've had nightmares. You haven't? Oh, I have. Okay. No, I did have a dream that um someone on this cellular device is a baby thief. Oh, Jenny. <gasps> Speaking of baby thief, I hope you're not gonna hurt me. God, you know I do this. I have buyer's remorse. There was something there for baby, and you did not get it. Yep. Yeah. What was it? Little cute polo boots. But I didn't know if she would have an issue with her baby having used items. Mm. So that's why I didn't get it. But they were the cutest pink polo boots. Like the little rain boots, you know? Oh, they were so cute. And they had so, the hot pink. I had a kid. I had a drink. Mm -hmm. And me and Jenny were buying clothes. Mm -hmm. And then she was like, you know what? I'm going to take her on a train ride at St. Jude. I was like, okay, cool. And I'm going to go do this little gym jumping off buildings class. Cool. So then I called her and was like, I really don't want to be in this class, so when are y'all going to be done? So I can pick her up. Mm -hmm. She's talking about, well, you can come get her on Sunday. I said, that's two days away. I'm not, you're, you're not going to have my child till Sunday. You're not even Why a parent. Why do you even have a child? Um, I don't know. She got a child. It she just don't, appeared. She don't need no child. I walked outside and Jenny had a stroller. Mm -mm. So, yeah. 
So she's a baby thief. But anyway, yep. comment below if you guys have had those terrifying dreams of being somewhere without a mask. Because I sure have. Maybe that's just my whole thing, that anxiety that I got. I don't know. But anyway, okay, guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> Why is that song in your head? I don't know. She's got me singing. That's that old R. Kelly. What is it called? Th it was called Thonya. Like Thonya. Thonya. Yeah. It was. <laughs> it was know. probably one of the dumbest songs, but it had a catchy, catchy beat. I guess. I don't know how, like I just found it on YouTube. Yeah. Something. Yeah. So anyway, is it time for you to go to work, dear? It went by so fast. So Jordan's on his way to work. Look, the sun is back out again. And everything. So, yeah. I have an hour, about an hour, and then I'll be off. So I think I'm going to go get myself together. Make myself just, you know, look a little bit better, feel like something. I'm not going to do anything immaculate. But I have on these slouchy joggers and this fitted shirt this, and sneakers. I look, I don't know. Here, let me just let you guys see me real fast. Let's see. Can you guys see me? Um, let's see. Where should I place you? I think I'm going to place you right here. Sorry. Place you right there. Look at this. Look at this. I look so like... I don't even know. Can you guys see me? Look at this. And then I have on these sneakers. I mean, these pants are kind of cute. They have rhinestones, but they're so freaking big. They didn't used to be this big on me. <laughs> they didn't used to be this big, but they're very comfortable. So anyway, bye, Jor. Bye, Ma. We love you. I love you. Everybody loves me. That's right, baby. And God loves you, too. Talk to you later. Bye. All right, guys. We're on our way into... Burlington. Dun, 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 Burlington. Now listen to me when we get inside the stuff. Mm -hmm. Don't touch nothing. <laughs> oh my god. What is wrong with this child? Alright. Oh, your ankles? Mm -hmm. Okay, we're going straight to that area. We will not go over there. Where'd you want to go? Oh, that's right. You're looking for a fanny pack. I'm trying to, like, detour you from. Just anywhere near clothes. The only thing I want to see is work like leggings for some reason. I'm gonna get it to leggings. How pretty. Oh, here's that thing again that I wanted.
was right. You bought something. Child, I bought more than something. All right, so y'all see this container right here? This container I bought because I want to clear off my vanity. So I bought this to put a lot of the stuff that's in my vanity in here, and then I'm going to slide it underneath my vanity area. So all this stuff in here is Kayla's. I don't know what you're talking about. So Kayla got her a fanny pack from Five Below. Oh, this fell. Cute. And then she bought a pair of shorts from Five Below. Cute. So we just wanted to show y'all a few, you know, this stuff. Because y'all know we're in the store and I'm like, hope they're going to show us what they bought. I'm showing you what we bought. We went to Marshall's. I got some stuff for the kitchen. I got these bamboo sponges for the kitchen. They were only three bucks. And then I got this bamboo um, brush scrubber for the kitchen too, for the kitchen sink. And then I got, oh God, I thought I didn't have the suction cups on the side. I got this to put in my sink. It was only four bucks. And so I got this, it's that um, oh. thing. Yeah, making a noise. Um, I got this to put on the side of my sink. So I can put my sponge and my brush in it. So we want to keep reaching underneath the sink and stuff for it. And then I got, y'all, I was so excited. William Sonoma, William Sonoma, and they were on clearance for $6. These are the salad toss things. So I was really excited about that. And then I got me some healthy kind bars, peanut butter chocolate, yum, yum, yum. This is crunch. Yeah, just a, but it says like, it says <laughs> chewy with the crunch, but I'm hoping it's not a lot of crunches. I don't. Uh, I, it's a thing with me, texture thing with me. All right, and then we went to Burlington, and I got myself <laughs> a nice kitchen knife. Even though I have all those knives, I wanted a really good kitchen knife. Kayla got her some Hello Panda strawberry crunchy shells. Good so, yeah. strawberry in there. And then I bought me some Chewy Cube Warheads. I'm sharing those. And yeah, we can share these. <laughs> I mean, you can get 10 pieces for 110 calories. Believe you, I'm going to count these, but at least I'll have my treat if I want it. And then I bought some black athletic socks. Kayla got some weed. <laughs> <laughs> some hemp. Um, what do you call face wipes and then I bought some hair uh, just really for my best friend she loves those hair things and then I got this one to go uh, on the top of my vanity to store like my lotions and stuff like that in it so it kind of matches this thing and then I also went to Kroger's just to get some food stuff and yeah, leave it up to me I found two nightgowns that I really like and they were like eight bucks a piece so I love to sleep in stuff like this it's just comfortable my arms are not I gotta be loose at in bed at night so that is it guys I hope you liked our little haul talk to you later all right guys so I thought I'd show you <laughs> a little bit better of um, outfit of the day I I kept on the same shirt I just put on these leggings that I had got from Marshall's and they're the Rachel Zoe and then I just threw this jacket on because it's cold outside. So I just thought I'd throw this on. And since it's, you know, I feel like the two grays complement each other. And then I have on these little sketcher. I don't know if you guys can see. You know what? I'll just take them off so you can see. I have on these cute little sketcher sneakers. These cute. Earl got these for me when I was having trouble with my the heel of my foot back in the summer of uh, 2020. So, yeah. So I just thought... You know, got that on. You know, got all my little jewelry. I used to do this all the time. My little earrings, my necklace. I haven't done an outfit of the day in a while, y'all. Got all my little bracelets and stuff. So, yeah, this is it. I just wanted to show y'all that I don't look raggedy all the time. I know I was looking hideous today. So, I just wanted to show you guys that. I am getting ready to eat. Um, but I'm going to get comfortable first. Um... I got myself a couple of subs from Kroger. They're the Boar's Head. And I was so surprised they had like the calorie count at the store uh, in Kroger. So, um, 
but these actually have it on here so this one's like 350 calories for uh, it says smoke master black forest ham so so that wasn't bad at all I like the calorie count on that and then I love Italian subs and so this one was 440 calories so I'm gonna put that into my fitness pal and I decided I wanted some baked chips to go with that that's gonna be my dinner tonight it's Friday night so Earl when he got himself something Kayla um, bought her um, got she heated up some boudin that we had in the um, refrigerator um, do you got maybe not everybody let me just show y'all what boudin is because not everybody I keep anyway let me just show y'all this is boudin it's like a sausage but it's stuffed with Cajun seasonings right and rice and ground beef that's what this is stuffed with and it's so good and we like to eat it with crackers let me see how many calories this thing is it's quite a bit <laughs> For two and a half ounces is 140 calories so probably for this whole link I'm thinking maybe 280 280 maybe 350 for a whole link something like that not worth it for me but this is this is so worth it I'm probably gonna add a little mayo either mayo or a little olive oil or something like that on it and then I ran out of this drink here. I told y'all I love this stuff here. I can get it out. This, ah, uh, love that. And it's zero calories. So that is what I'm having for dinner. I'm having a sub sandwich, some chips, and then that drink. And that is it for me. So yeah, I'm gonna call it a Friday night and then I'm going to uh, see you guys tomorrow. Sup peeps? It is Saturday, and your girl is headed to the park. It's cold outside. Oh, Lord, I'm getting real close to this car. I ain't paying attention, y'all. I am not paying attention to the car. Oh, I am very close to this car. Let me sweep up a little bit. Very good. Um, yes, it is Saturday morning. Barely Saturday morning. It's 10 or 10 1. I don't know if I should tell y'all now. Yeah, I'm going to tell y'all now. I'm going to go ahead and tell you. So, y'all remember last week? And I told y'all what my uh, weight was. Remember, I said, you want to know my weight? Just click on this video, right? Well, child, I was 176. It is now Saturday, and it is time to report my new weight as of this morning. Your girl is 171.2. 171.2. I almost lost a total of five pounds this week, baby. It was, oh, y'all, why did I keep doing that? Oh, my God. Am I losing my head? I keep doing, like, okay, I've been doing that a lot. Thank God for this type of technology. Let me know. I've been doing that a lot. I've, I bet y'all was screaming at the, uh, at your screen, at your screens, saying, girl, put your seatbelt on. What's wrong with you? I, I am an advocate of seatbelts, but for the oh, I know what it is. I'm gonna can I tell y'all what it is? And I keep saying it every time I wear my fanny pack in the car, like around my waist, it's some type. It feels like security. So it feels like you know I got my seatbelt around my waist. That's what it is. Cause I thought I was losing my mind, but I'm not. Thank God. So anyway, y'all. Yes, one seventy one. Point two, y'all. It's forty-eight degrees outside. That's not too bad. So when I woke up this morning. Alexa told me it was forty-two degrees, and I was like, okay. But y'all know I got my furry monster with me. I got that with me, 
And yes, child, we finna go do some more. Oh, also, um, I am doing a challenge with uh, this lady from YouTube. Her name on Fitbit and my fitness pal is Ivory C. I can't remember the name of her channel. I'm gonna put it right here. I'm gonna put her channel name right here. And she is totally awesome. I'm gonna tell you why. Like, she has lost tons of weight, right? A lot of weight. And she knows a lot about like how to lose it. You know, she gives you tidbits on how to lose it and stuff like that. I mean, she even told me, showed me how to figure out how much weight I was gonna lose at the end of the week. Like seriously. And I was like, what? Never knew that. Never knew that. So yeah. Um, y'all gone over there if y'all are interested um, and check her out. Um, I did get a dark berry letter last night. It's gonna be a nice one. It's a juicy one. I think you guys are gonna find it very interesting. Um, so check me out on Wednesday. I actually wanted to do two Dear Dark Berries, and I may still because um, there's going to be one on me. Um, it's not really a Dear Dark Berry, but it's like more like information, you know what I mean? So, yeah. Um, but y'all, I have made it to the uh, park. My little favorite place. But anyway, let me tell y'all real fast. I'm part of a, a, a warrior weekend challenge. There's about, I don't know, seven, maybe seven to eight ladies. And we're all competing against each other. So let me just check it out right now and see. God dog it. Y'all know what I forgot to bring. I'm going to have to go back home. I'm going to have to go back home. I forgot my, uh, my earphones. Cause I want to listen to my book. God dog. Okay, I might have to go back to the house. She don't feel like it, but I guess let me go and do it now while I'm thinking about it. God darn it. But anyway, I'm a part of this challenge, right, guys? Let me let me see real fast. And um, where we're just competing against each other for the weekend to see how many steps, you know, and who wins and stuff like that. I can't believe. It don't take me long to get to the house. But, um, I wanted to see where everybody was right now. I guess one lady was banging it, baby. She was doing the thing, doing the thing. So, yeah, we got one lady that is at 14,000 steps right now. Pay attention to the road. Be no incidents. So yeah, 14,000 steps right now. And um, your girl, <laughs> only got 914. So, but y'all know how I do, y'all. Yesterday, I crushed it. I had like 18,000 steps yesterday. And that's because, like I said, I don't, what I don't do, oh, you know, I forgot to do two things because I was too busy trying to get on this camera and talk to y'all. But I need to, I forgot to, um, the guy's gonna come by today and take the lights down and I forgot to put the box out. And there's another info. It's crazy. I was already at the park, already too. But yeah, so I am feeling like this week I'm gonna crush it. Now, this is another thing that I need to tell y'all real fast. Um, I'm gonna walk today. And I'm going to attempt to walk tomorrow because the weather is supposed to be really kind of nasty, ugly, you know. Hopefully I can get out in enough time to get it done, to at least get my 10,000 in, because y'all know how I be. But I am going to take Sundays off after tomorrow. After tomorrow, all the other Sundays, I'm going to go ahead and take that Sunday off. I kind of don't want to because I crushed it so much, so well this week. But... I'm going to do that because I think my body has to rest. And especially that my heel on my on my uh, left foot is trying to give me problems again. And it's because your girl has walked every day this week. <laughs> 
seven days a week because I am a seven day a weeker type of person. That's what I do. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. All right, so let me run in here, get my earphones, and I will check back in with you guys a little later, all right? thrift store just trying to buy some time really I was looking for that thing it was a Valentine's cutout for the outdoors of your home but I cannot find it so just kind of looking at it Say hello to Angela. Miss Angela, I have your bed ready and waiting for you <laughs> to do your acrobatic acts. <laughs> so excited. All right. Enjoy those jelly bellies and I'm going to enjoy my barbacoa. I will. All right. Bye, guys. Bye. See you soon. So right. I decided for dinner I'm going to make a big pot of chicken tortilla soup because it's um, supposed to be cold tomorrow. And I'm going to make a stop here at HEB. I am going to just pick up a few things. I have everything else that I need. All I need is some cilantro and onions. They usually have it already mixed for you. A couple of avocados to garnish. And then I'm going to get maybe some chili powder. And maybe a little lime as well. So, going into it. I'm dedicated. It's something about the beginning of the year. Like, I feel like I'm back 
in 2018. <laughs> I don't know if we wish we were or not. So I don't want to go through 2020 again. But 2018, at the beginning of 2018, 2018 was a great year for me when it came to my health um, and my weight loss. Like, I did the doggone thing. I did the thing, okay? Um, you know what? If I think about it, I am going to try to... It's a nice mirror. Um, I am going to try to um, put in two pictures. Did you guys see those pictures of me? The before and the after was ridiculous. Um, but I did it. I did it. And um, I can do it again. And I want, like I said, my trouble is maintaining. So if I can maintain, that'd be great. I am... Um, on Wednesday, you will see a video. You'll see a, a Dear Darkberry video on Wednesday morning. And it's gonna be talking about weight loss. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be talking about weight loss. I'm, I'm trying to think about if I'm going to put two topics in one video because I did get a Dear Darkberry letter, but um, I definitely want to get this one in for myself about weight loss for you guys. So look forward to Wednesday. There may be two videos, two topics in that one video or just the um, the one video, the one topic in, in the one video on Wednesday. And then on Friday, you'll get to see me um, do another motivational clean video. And that video is me taking down all my Christmas decor and, um, you know, kind of sprucing up the house a little bit, you know, trying to... It's, it's so funny because when you put up the Christmas decor, you're like, you're so proud and everything looks so good and you're so happy about it and it brings festivities. And then when you take it down, it's another happy moment. And it's because you, you're, you're getting your house back to yourself. It looks a little cleaner because like now everything is kind of like, kind of like falling by the wayside. You know what I mean? Like if ornaments are not contained in the spot it needs to be, it just doesn't look as good anymore to you. So I am ready to get the tree down, get that spot all nice and clean again. Um, you know, just get the, the place to, to be normal once again, it'll be nice. Um, I did want to uh, maybe keep some things up and the only thing that I would like to keep up is like um, like put stuff in my lanterns that are on the credenza and to um, you know to make it look more like hey, it's Valentine's is coming that's it so we will see how that goes all right, guys, let me get to the mall. I'm going to, of course, take you guys with me. Um, I wish I could have some of you people with me to exercise with me. So I wish you guys would come. Um, yeah, that would be great, wouldn't it? We'd have, like, a little exercise group. But uh, right, right now, I am part of, part of a group that we're doing, a weekend warrior group. So I don't know if some of you guys have a Fitbit I tell you what because I didn't think about it until just now if you have a Fitbit and you actually want to um, maybe compete with me or you know get some motivation because I'm walking every day um, you can find me on Fitbit Fitbit at Darkberry32 and then um, yeah, so if you need an email or something like that, it's darkberry32 at gmail.com. And it's the same on my fitness pal. If you want to follow me on my fitness pal, that would be okay too. I would be fine with that. And then I don't know, I think I don't know if you're able if you're able, because I really don't 
have anybody else that I actually um, keep up with on my fitness pal anymore like I used to but I don't know if I'm able to like if you guys are gonna be able to see what I eat you know what I mean because I saw something the other day that showed that hey I completed my diary and then it had a little uh, little link on there that I can click on to see what I ate but I don't know if you guys will be able to see it so check it out welcome come on if y'all want to do that that's fine with me if you don't that's fine with me but I just wanted to let you know that it's an option that you can find me on Fitbit and you can find me on my fitness pal at darkberry32 all right okay y'all <laughs> so I'm at the mall right and I was like there's no one here at the mall like what is going on so I went online and the mall doesn't open until 12. They started to open up late and I was like, oh my God. So I'm watching the security guard as he's pulling at the doors. And I'm like, well, maybe they're still gonna open early for like people that like to walk around, da, 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 da. So he just, I asked him, I was like, you know, yeah. I said, oh gosh, I haven't been in a while. You know, I like to walk around, you know, like when it rains outside. And he said that um, they'll open up at 10 a.m. for that. So, um, that's cool. I am probably, I'm not going to drive around or whatever, but I'm just thinking to myself, let me just kind of drive around and maybe there's some places I can actually go into and walk for a little bit until they open. Because I only got like maybe 30 minutes. If not, then I'll just go back to my little parking spot and wait until it opens. But I was like, oh my God, girl, wait until 12 o'clock. That's going to waste a lot of my time. Like... Or I could have still been in the bed sleep, but I'm gonna go over here and just um, kind of walk around Ross. I don't even know if they're open yet. Um, just to, you know, just to kind of look at some things and just to kind of keep moving. I don't know if they're open. Let's see if they're open. I'll look on my phone to see if they're open. So for like a good 30 minutes, I can walk around here. Let's look at the time. Let's look at the time. If I can see this far, <laughs> this far away. Now open at 8 a.m. All right, all right, Ross. All right, Ross. <laughs> Ross came in a clip. What is it, a clutch or whatever? Yes, child. All right, Ross. So I'm gonna go in here for a little bit and um, just kind of, you know, like I said, just walk around, look around, at least that way. Um, I probably won't bring my camera because if it, well, I don't know, I might take my camera in, but I don't want anybody to be looking at me all cray cray. I'm just gonna dash in here. I don't think I'm gonna need my jacket. I'm just gonna dash in here. I hope it ain't cold in there. Y'all know me, I don't like being cold, child. So yeah, all right guys. Let me check it out. <laughs> Yeah. 